Get ready. Efteling is a theme park located in the Netherlands that opened in 1952. It is considered something of a hidden gem in itself within the theme park world, as it's not as well known as Disney parks despite having the same calibre of attractions and theming. Its attendance has risen over the years, as people begin to discover the magic that Efteling has to offer. In this list, we look at our favourite hidden gems in Efteling that make this park so special. Get ready. Number 8. The Fairy Tale Forest Let's start by saying that the Fairy Tale Forest in Efteling is not a hidden gem by any means. It could be argued that this is the jewel in the crown of Efteling, and is the original opening day attraction from 1952. The reason it makes our hidden gems list in Efteling is because it is so full of hidden gems that it would take us all day to go through all the secrets and easter eggs that this area has to offer. A trail through the forest brings you past 30 locations, all from different European fairy tales and fables, with many different interactive and sensual experiences. Some highlights are Hansel and Gretel's gingerbread house that really smells like vanilla, and the talking parrot who repeats what you say. You could really spend a full day in this area experiencing new things, and all of it is hidden within the dense forest. Number 7. Diorama Hidden behind the steam carousel lies an elaborate miniature world. Diorama is a 60 metre long exhibition that can be viewed from both sides. It showcases various landscapes, both realistic and fantastical. You will find mountains, villages, seaside areas and running water. There are scenes both in day and night and you will see many different types of vehicles in operation. While portraying a miniature world, it's a massive exhibit and is certainly worth visiting when in Efteling. It is all indoors and can provide a nice break from the sun if you're visiting in the summer. There is also plenty of seating inside the area, so it can be a great place to take a break from exploring Efteling. Number 6. Pole's Kitchen In the grounds in front of Symbolica lies a kitchen. It's Pole's Kitchen and there are many reasons to visit. Firstly, the kitchen is out of control and you'll see cooking utensils spinning around the kitchen. You'll also hear kettles hissing, pots clanging and oven doors slamming. Secondly, this award-winning restaurant makes incredibly tasty pancakes, both sweet and savoury, and has an extensive menu. Lastly, you can buy pancake mix to make the secret recipe pancakes at home too. Paul is the cook for the palace, and you might even spot him with a stack of pancakes while you're on Symbolica. Number 5. Donkey, lift your tail. Okay, we're cheating a little bit here, because this hidden gem is in the fairy tale forest, but it's one of the greatest hidden gems in Efteling and we simply couldn't leave it out. In the middle of the village square in the fairy tale forest, there is a statue of a donkey. It is from a Brothers Grimm fairy tale called The Wishing Table, The Gold Ass and The Cudgel in the Sack. Enter 50 cent into the slot at the base of the statue and the donkey's tail will lift and a golden coin will pop out. This is certainly one of the most unique theme park souvenirs you can find anywhere in the world. Make sure to bring some loose change with you. Number 4. Symbolica has three different routes. This one may seem obvious to people who have visited the park multiple times, but it's easy to miss. When you're in the queue for Efteling, you will make a choice between the Hero Tour, the Music Tour, or the Treasure Tour. These three routes all have unique experiences and bring you to different areas of the palace, and this means you can go on Symbolica three different times and still see new things. While many of the scenes occur on all three routes, such as the Observatory, the Botanical Gardens, and the Royal Hall, the middle portion of the ride will be different on each route. So if you've been on Symbolica and you loved it, there's still two more routes for you to enjoy. Number 3. The Steam Train The Steam Train in Efteling circles the perimeter of the park and has two stations. One near Drumflucht and the other near Python at the back of the park. The full circuit takes just about 15 minutes and offers a refreshing break from a busy day at Efteling. The train runs throughout the day and you will be able to see the park from a very different perspective. You will even cross a bridge over the Gondoletta Lake. The steam train is easy to miss, but definitely worth doing. It's fully seated and sheltered, so it can offer a nice break from either the sun or the rain, depending on what time of year you visit. Number 2. The Efteling Museum The Efteling Museum is technically an attraction, but many might skip it as it's not a ride as such. It's a building near the centre of the park, filled with concepts and artefacts from the park's rich history. There's something for everyone in here. 
old maps and sketches for those who like to delve into the history, and interactive tables and games for younger guests looking to have fun. Overall, it's fantastic that Efteling honour their own history and heritage with documentation of the park's development through time. You can get around the museum in about 10 or 15 minutes. Number 1. Hungry Gargoyle Bins The bins in Efteling are one of the strangest things you're ever likely to see in a theme park. Dotted around the park are hungry gargoyles prepared to eat your paper rubbish. As you walk by, you'll hear them shout, and if you hold paper up to their mouths, they'll suck it right out of your hands and thank you for your trouble. It's a creative way to keep the park litter free, and a very unique experience that's exclusive to Efteling. There are many around the park, and each can be a hidden gem in itself to find as you explore Efteling. And that's our list of hidden gems in Efteling. Now you're ready. Did we miss any of your favourite hidden gems? Let us know in the comments below, and don't forget to subscribe for new weekly content.